Well, the Dance Ignition Lab concept was something that I developed through my research and MBA studies um, in arts management and also my own um, international research in dance and dance leadership and deve development of the art form. And I developed this concept uh, in response to a need for a new way of thinking about our models of practice and the way that dance crosses over uh, into multiple disciplines. Um, it was great to have the opportunity to come to Tronos uh, to try this first edition of it, um, to be invited through the Coracle Europe partnership, um, and uh, to have this space to explore the idea. Um, so yeah, we, we've been planning it for the past six months to, um, and selecting the artists. We had an open call um, and we received applications from all over the world, from, through, from many different continents. The appeal seems to be broad. So I was very happy with, with, the, with the response to that. And being here in Tronos and learning about dance in the region and how well supported it is, um, and to bring a different aspect of practice to share um, is quite fulfilling. What has surprised and pleased me is the way that the artists have come together. Um, they really invested themselves in this concept as well, the dance ignition, um, because they have found these common grounds. They've, they've, there was this spark between them. Um, they, they found that there are ideas that they share. And obviously, that was in some way curated by me uh, through the selection process, because I had to look at what their interests were and piece together the right combination. And I'm very happy with what's happening at the moment. Upstairs at the moment, we have um, a shared studio space, which is an unexpected outcome. Um, I had anticipated, you know, that perhaps people will connect with others and then find a space to work together. But what has happened is they've come together, they're sharing a space, the, there's different sparks off each other, they're supporting and helping each other with their ideas, they're, they're finding time to, to develop them further. Um, they're also very aware that there is a two weeks is a very short amount of time, which is the whole kind of ignition thing. It's something that sparks, something that has to happen in a quick time. So I've been facilitating it in a way that um, will help them to progress their ideas or to to feedback on their ideas to see what is feasibly um, what they can feasibly achieve within the two weeks. Um, in terms of their research. So the outcome of this residency is not necessarily an artistic product, a performance, but an idea. They are, I'm hoping at the end that they will be able to pitch an idea to me, to Cultivira, to, to this, this area, to the, um, for further research and maybe possibly to return for a longer residency period in the future. Um, and to explore what else the region has to offer them. Uh, they've been very, very supportive in, in what they're doing here. Yeah, and then my, my role as a curator has been very much, um, has, has kind of kicked in after the, after the first few days. Um, so where they knew, they, we, it was a process of getting to know each other and once they knew what I had to offer them, We've had this dialogue, this conversation happening, this feedback loop that I've been introduced, which is based on the lean strategies, tying it back to my own research. Um, and it seems to be working quite well. And I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing how it, how it works out. It's something that has been used in business. Um, so you've got the, the, lean, the lean model comes from manufacturing originally, and the um, kind of process, uh, the, the development of this idea that I am uh, pursuing or I'm researching is uh, the lean, lean startup model, which uh, was sort of developed by Eric Ries. And from that, I've taken this uh, feedback loop, the build, measure, learn feedback loop, and created a model of um, 
just a, a model of, of a response or a, more of a horizontal discourse between the artists and myself. Um, I initially applied this model in a policy context in my research and I saw the potential for it in terms of um, a quick, sharp, um, cutting out the excess uh, situation where you need a feedback and you need to pursue particular strategies within a short time frame. So I felt it would be appropriate for this kind of context. They seem to be responding really well to it. Um, they're all very conscious that they have a short space of time and that they have so many ideas that they want to pursue. The, the one thing that we've tried to, well, I've tried to keep in the consciousness is, is the fact that if you do have this residency space, there is always a risk of going down a rabbit hole of you know, one idea and, and getting lost in that. So to apply a strategy such as this, I feel, and this is all an experiment and ex exploration, it is still research for me and for them, uh, to apply a strategy like this, I feel will um, give them a little bit different focus. So they are more responsive and they can pivot, which is, which is a term that Reese uses in terms of the lean, the, this model. Um, they can pivot on an idea, um, take a shift in direction uh, in response to testing their models. So upstairs at the moment, they are now applying a frame. They're, they're, they've developed an, an idea of improvisation, which involves movement, projections, sound responses. Um, and uh, this, um, uh, yeah, and, and what they will do is they will explore it, experiment with it, and then take it, take it aside, feedback on it, see what works, what doesn't work, and immediately go in and try it again. So they have this loop and then they refine the idea more. Well, I hope to have um, many different iterations of the Dance Ignition Lab. We are hoping again to come back to Tronos next year and, um, and try a, a, another, another residency. But we're looking for other partners as well to try this idea. Um, I've had a lot of interest uh, from other countries, um, which will hopefully develop a, a, broader, a broader network. So we'll try it. This, this model can be a two-week express lab or, or sorry, a two-day express lab up until two or three weeks, two weeks I think is that optimum for this particular um, model of working. Um, so yeah, we were hoping to, to try other ways and bring in other influences. So one of the things I quite like to do the next time I come here is to connect with the design industry and to bring in some of their ideas and to see how they can impact on the residences here.